Yo people, what's up? This is Malcolm Extreme, the content machine, coming at you with another reaction video today. Today we're going to be reacting to Subliminal, the official pre-release trailer. Uh, I'm assuming it's a game, a game that's coming out soon, maybe. Uh, and uh, yeah, we're going to react to the trailer, but before we do, make sure you hit that like button, hit the subscribe button, and hit the bell for more notifications from the content machine, Malcolm Extreme. Let's get started. Looks photorealistic. The fuck was that? Dude, one thing I do like is like the filter. Like this sort of uh, VHS filter. I really like it. Now, I'll most likely be turning it off in games. <laughs> I'll most likely be turning it off, but I do like the filter. I do like the aesthetic. Viewer expression is advised. Oh, dude, this is kind of loud. Hello and welcome. I'll be your guide today as you venture back into your past and relive some of your most treasured and sacred core me 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 memories. As you I'm getting experience, please try your best not to get distracted. And let oh, what do they call that genre? I'm getting those vibes right now. As doing so can be dangerous and introduce unconscious, unregulated, and suppressed. Okay, I think they're going for horror. Analog horror. That's what they're going for. Or not. The beginning reminded me of analog horror a lot. Dude, this is photorealistic, bro. Ah, I see you've made it to the waterworks. Please, don't be shy. Try out a few of those whirling water slides you loved so much. So I don't know, but I think I saw a preview for a game that was like this. It's, it's, it's liminal spaces. I do, I do like the idea of liminal spaces, Wait. like the back rooms and stuff. No. No. Dude, this is like a playpen. Dude, these. Oh my god. Oh my god, dude, that looked like a rat-looking thing. But these little net things, bro, when I would like when I used to go on these things when I was a kid, these net things made me so uneasy, bro. I felt like they were going to break at any time. They made me feel so uneasy. But I went on them anyway. <laughs> oh, dude. Dude, I honestly don't think the game is going to be like this. I honestly don't think But then again, I could be wrong. Because, uh... What was that one? What Body cam. It had that realistic look, and it maintained, too. I haven't played it, but, like, people like that game. Dude, will I get copyrighted for this? I don't think so. Sounds like it came out of the 1940s, so I should be safe. Oh my god, I knew it. I knew that thing was gonna turn and look at me. <laughs> oh, dude, I got the shivers right now. I just got the shivers. I don't know why. Oh my god. Dude, I love how like when you're scared it just gets blurry. Dude, is this like the back rooms? The back rooms game? Subliminal. Alright, alright. Dude, I love the idea of like liminal spaces and stuff. I'm gonna let the trailer play out because they might have more releasing on Christmas. Releasing on Christmas. Damn. All right, all right. I'll be looking out. I'll be looking out. I haven't played a horror game in a long ass time. Maybe, maybe I should do this. Maybe I should do this as a horror game. I love. Like, in the beginning, when it had the filter, when it had, like, the VHS filter, I thought it was going to be, like, an analog 
horror type game, but then it just switched up into uh, liminal spaces, like the back rooms type deal. And you know, I like I like that genre. I like I really do. Let me know what you think. Let me know if you're going to be looking out for this game. Uh, comment, like, subscribe, hit the bell for more notifications from the content machine. Malcolm Extreme, take it easy.